Petland Pets make life better. Today we're talking about the introduction of a new fish into your aquarium. Uh, it's a very critical step and we've got to do this right. I'm Phil from Petland and I'm going to give you tips today on how to do this right to actually have a successful landing of your fish in your new, the new fish in your aquarium uh, to make sure it has a happy, healthy start and, and we eliminate as many issues as possible. So the first step once you get your fish home is what you want to do is actually start floating the fish and the bag that it's in in the top of your aquarium. Okay, and we're going to place this in here and the importance of this is what we're doing is actually slowly warming up the water that's in the bag to the tank conditions or for the matter if it's a goldfish we could be cooling the temperature down. It really depends on your environment at home. Ultimately we want the temperature of the water in the bag to be identical to the temperature of the water in your fish tank to eliminate the chance of a, sh of a temperature shock when we introduce the fish. Okay. The second step, once the bag's been floating for about 10 or 15 minutes we want to open up the bag and we want to start introducing small amounts of water from your aquarium into the fish bag itself. So opening the bag up, uh, taking an apparatus, a, a nice clean uh, aquarium safe apparatus, so whether it's a, a plastic jug or a cup or a, or a plastic cup that's never been used for anything else, that would be ideal. Um, dipping it out of your tank, pouring it into the bag, and that'll slowly start mixing the, the two water uh, chemistries together so that the chemistry is that, uh, as much balanced as possible before we introduce the fish in. The third step right before you want to introduce your fish is to actually reconfigure everything in your aquarium. So your rocks, your plants, your ornaments, you want to move them around, you want to confuse the fish that are in there as to exactly where their territory is. If they have territory established and you introduce a new fish, they're going to be very defensive, they're going to want to attack or, or defend their territory territory and attack the new fish and it's going to make for a very rough start for the new fish. So move everything around, everything becomes chaotic, they're all confused, uh, then what we're going to do next is actually net the fish out of the bag and introduce it into the aquarium. Uh, when we put that in, he kind of slips in under the radar while there's mass confusion going on. It can have the same chance to establish territory as everybody else and it'll be a much, much safer approach. And at this point, this critical that, as I said, we net the fish out. We don't ever dump the bag into the aquarium. Never want to mix two sources of water. Uh, it's just not a good practice. It's a lot safer for your established fish and your aquarium to just take a net, net the fish out, and add them into the water. Use these tips the next time you bring a fish home. It'll give a much happier, healthier start to your fish and a better chance. I'm Phil from Petland. Have yourself a good day. Petland Pets make life better.